federal safety regulators are pushing to get 52 million airbags recalled. They're saying those airbags could explode and cause injuries, even death. Troubleshooter Nidia Han breaks down the dangers and tells us why these airbags have not yet been recalled. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration is trying to force the airbag makers to issue a recall after NHTSA says at least two people have died and seven people have been injured since 2009. The airbags are made by ARC and Delphi and reportedly they are in 2008 to 2018 models of cars made by General Motors, Ford, Tesla, Toyota, Hyundai, Kia, Mercedes-Benz, BMW and Volkswagen. The company so far has refused to issue a recall and fix all of these cars that have these airbag inflators. And this is NHTSA going down the road of saying they have to under the law. To this end, NHTSA has scheduled a hearing for October, saying it believes these airbags are defective and put people at risk. The federal agency is saying these airbag inflators may rupture when the vehicle's airbag is commanded to deploy, causing metal debris to be forcefully ejected into the passenger compartment of the vehicle. Consumer Reports tells us this push for a recall and hearing is an unusual move for the agency. They're only taking the step because they feel very confident in the data and the analysis that they've uh, done. ARC, the airbag maker, disputes the findings, claiming its extensive field testing did not find any defects. Now, I know consumers are wondering what they should do. Unfortunately, there isn't enough information right now. The exact vehicles have not yet been publicly identified by NHTSA, but certainly we are watching this closely and we will keep you updated as we get more information. I'm Nidia Han, Channel 6 Action News.